For the ball valve rebuilding process, you will need vacuum grease, a hammer, a 7 8 inch open wrench or adjustable wrench, and a small flathead screwdriver. You will also need the 1.5 inch ball valve rebuild kit, part number VAC 2743-4. Hello, my name is Guillermo Torres and I am with Vacuum Atmospheres Service Department. Today we are going to show you how to rebuild a one and a half inch triangular manual ball valve. A seven eighths inch open wrench or a uh, adjustable crescent wrench such as this one is needed for the uh, process. To begin, we are going to uh, loosen the uh, ball valve's uh, securing nut. Turn counterclockwise to loosen this nut. And proceed by removing the nut. And the ball valve handle. Remove the ball valve seats and o rings. and position the ball valve um, stem in such a way where the uh, ball valve can be easily removed. Gently tap on the valve stem to release it from the valve body. Proceed by removing the two o-rings and the, and the plastic washer. Remove the rebuild kit from the, uh, from the plastic bag. Rebuild kit part number VAC 2743-4 is the part number that corresponds to this uh, ball valve. And the next step is to apply a thin coat of vacuum grease to each uh, piece. Reinstall the new lubricated components to the valve stem. Once the uh, valve stem has been uh, put back together, reinsert it into the valve body and push it straight out. Next you want to position the uh, valve stem so that you can reinstall the brass ball onto the valve body followed by installing the seats and o-rings to the valve body. And do the same for the opposite side. So seat. And o-ring. Lastly, um, install the uh, ball valve handle and
I'm securing it with the uh, handle nut. And tighten uh, with your open wrench or your uh, crescent wrench. And tighten uh, by turning this clockwise. And now the uh, one and a half inch ball valve has been rebuilt.